All right, Jack, just talk about uh, getting a shutout over the uh, really the hottest team in the league coming in. Yeah, it's awesome. Uh, great for uh, Simon to get a shout out there. You know, he's been he's been really good all year. So uh, yeah, really happy to to get that for him. And yeah, I thought we thought we played uh, really well defensively. Didn't give him much. So that was a uh, big key for ours. And uh, yeah, we went out there and executed that. You guys had to really fight for ice. There, there wasn't a lot of free skating out there. Yeah, definitely. Uh, we knew they were kind of trying to uh, kind of slow it down a little bit and kind of trap us there in the neutral zone. So. Uh, we, we had worked on some things throughout the week to kind of prepare for that, and I uh, thought we did a good job uh, trying to get it behind them and just go to work and create offense that way. Favorite goal of the night? What was your favorite goal of the night? Uh, Second one. No, I think Ty, uh, Ty's uh, shot there. It was a good play from all all three of us kind of get uh, get in through the zone there. Tanner made a great play to find me, and uh, I found Ty there in the slot, and you know he's not he's not missing from there, so it was great. Did you feel like the team maybe uh, was energized after having that last weekend off? Yeah, I think that came out a great time for us there uh, to recharge for these last three weeks here down the stretch to, to really make a push. And, uh, yeah, we got in some good work last week and this week to, to kind of recover but also prepare for this weekend. So, yeah, I think that was really big for us. Um, you guys, uh, you could really feel the crowd tonight. I noticed there were some – you always uh, recognize them, you guys do as a team, but uh, – feel that tonight yeah yeah definitely it was uh it was really awesome the crowd was really loud tonight they've been great all year and um yeah it's really helps when when they get behind us and the, and they're loud and yeah it's just an awesome place to play and uh yeah just really special and uh with the hockey community here and they're always supporting us so it's re it's really fun to play in front of them Jack, as we get closer to the end of the regular season and the standings get a little tighter each game sort of feels like it has a little bit more weight to it do you change your approach at all before these big games i think we just trying to Wanted to kind of adopt that uh, playoff mindset. These uh, even before the break, we just started really focusing on that, and every point is so big, and so we just want to play every weekend like it's our last, and um, just kind of have that playoff mindset going into every game. That um, you know we we need the points as many points as we can get here, and uh, we just want to keep getting better these last couple of weeks and uh, make a push here. Any other questions? Can we get your thoughts on the coach bobblehead? What did you think of? Uh, was it a good likeness? What uh, yeah, I thought it yeah, it was pretty good. It's fun to fun to always fun to get those. Uh, the, I know the Durango one was pretty good last last year, so I'm sure the uh, the fans enjoyed seeing uh, Coach uh, have a bobblehead tonight. So yeah, it was fun. You didn't, everybody didn't try to make his head bobble. Or anything. You didn't give him a hard time. <laughs> no, no, didn't give him a hard time for that one. But we probably probably should have. That would have been funny.